What's up guys, what's going on? Sorry, so I'm here on a video today. Uh, finally doing that 20K room tour. Uh, I got my friend filming it, his name's OG Frampod. Actually has his own YouTube channel in the description below. Make sure to check it out. He makes videos like once a month, right about. You know, he's nodding his head. He hasn't posted in like two months. Frampod invades Europe. Yeah, he's invading Europe soon too, but uh, to get out, I'm gonna be doing the room tour for 20K. That's not my room, that's just like some random shit on the wall. It's my sister's room, and then uh, let's go in here and get into the room, so. Here we got the ghetto door that actually doesn't close. I mean, look at the, but let me just show you. You can just like, it's closed and it doesn't even, yeah, shitty. Shitty door. I'll put it here, it's the room. Let's just like do a pan of it real quick. And uh, we will get started. Where are we gonna get started? Let's go this way. All right, start over here. Well, I uh, got some random socks on top of my backpack. Got some dope KDs. I know how those are out. Got some light switches. Got a shit ton of these doors that people always ask me about on live streams. It's actually a closet. This door's actually fucking broken because one of my friends broke it. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, this is my chair. Got some pillows that should actually be on my bed. Uh, we kind of just like friends come over and move it out, chill on it. Got a MacBook that I haven't opened in like six months. Used to be what I recorded on back in the ghetto days. Used to record like Happy Wheels and Minecraft on this shit. Got the charger, got a tennis ball, got some pants, got just my closet full of clothes and like a couple boxes, like my laptop box and shit. We got like a clock up there, nothing important. And uh, I got a bean bag over in the corner, which also pull out when people come over, so I got like a shit ton of chairs. And uh, let's see over here, we got my bed, place where I sleep, but pretty soon, whenever my sister decides to move out, I'm uh, gonna be moving my computer there, and then I can actually sleep in peace while I render. Uh, but pretty much the bed, we got like this comfy ass pillow over there. Uh, what else? About it, over there on my dresser with like. Just literally the most random assortment of shit ever. Like, I think I got some. I think I got an owl in the back. Got a Assassin's Creed 3 axe. Got a Crown Royale bag with full of quarters. Got a weed necklace. A bunch of shit from Mexico. Some ibuprofen. Shooting sleeves. Headbands. Tape measure. Aviators. Deodorant. And yeah, that's it with that. Uh, just kind of empty space over there so I can open that shit. And here, right here, we have the amazingness. Place where it all happens. The setup. So, uh, go in depth now? Yeah. Yeah, all right, so pretty much we'll just start up top. Uh, actually start behind, I guess. We'll start, actually I'll start with kind of, no. I don't know, whatever. Uh, here, got a big ass four terabyte external backup drive I just like have it on my monitors it's huge use it for all the video storing got some turtle beaches that I will talk about later because that's actually part of my really ghetto setup I'll need to talk about got some uh what are, what are these Audio Technica ATH-M50 is probably the greatest headphones I've ever bought they were like a hundred bucks on sale I always use these audio quality is great and we have some shitty earbuds where I don't feel like messing up my hair not that I have any anymore shit got cut a napkin for some reason. Got like two bucks. Uh, got a bunch of shit. And then here we got the receiver for the Turtle Beach, which I'll talk about more in a sec. Then I just kind of chill my PlayStation controller here because I played PlayStation on this monitor as well as being a second monitor. Then we got to the Logitech G710 Plus. It's my new mechanical keyboard. It doesn't show up on recording with a loud ass clicky noise. I actually sold that keyboard to my friend for 50 bucks and then bought Mario Kart with those 50 bucks. But uh, this is a great keyboard, I actually highly recommend it. Also, all the stuff is going to be in the description down below. I'll try to leave links to like the Amazon page if you guys want any. Uh, here, we got the trusty mic I've had for probably three years. Uh, also, pop filter I've had for like a year, half a year maybe. But super trusty mic, it's a blue snowball. Honestly, if you're gonna start a YouTube channel, just get this mic. It is one of the best you can get quality for quality for price on the best and then the pop filter it's a bit unnecessary but it kind of filters out some of the pops and shit that happens so it's it's nice and it does work with the blue snowball uh, over here in the back we just got some speakers I got like two years ago at 
on a Black Friday sale. They're like 20 bucks, and there's also a base down below. I'll talk about that in a second. But you can kind of pan right there. It's kind of hidden behind the shit. I'll kind of show it off more in a sec. And then up here we got water bottles, more ghetto earbuds, Bluetooth speaker that was like 10 bucks and it's from China. Uh, my camcorder that I'm not using because I can't find the charger, which is bad. And over here by this, actually, we got one more thing. We got the Microsoft uh, wireless adapter for PC, so I can actually connect. Uh, I can actually connect this handy thing to my PC if I want to play. But I think they just released the Xbox One controller drivers, so I don't really need that anymore. That does it for up there. So let's go down below and uh, over here. We got the monster thing that runs the channel. So inside the computer we have uh, the processor is a Intel i7 3770K best processor that was like best normal processor like none of that Xeon or whatever shit. What's well, a best processor back when I got it like a year ago. Uh, the GPU is a AMD Radeon 7970 got 8 gigs of RAM, 2 terabyte internal normal hard drive and then the main hard drive is a 256 gigabyte solid state where I put all my commonly used apps. It's got a bunch of fans. It's actually got some fans up in the top. A uh, bunch of expansion bays on the inside. It's got some fans on the interior as well over on the left and right side panels and plenty of room inside like this case is a monster. Uh, just absolutely awesome case. I could fit whatever I wanted in here if I really wanted to. And it's running Windows 7 because I had to get it back when there was kind of a debate between which is better now. I'd probably say if you were to get it, get Windows 8 because that's going to give you more performance and Windows 8 is a lot better with solid states. Definitely takes more advantage of it. And uh, you can kind of a liquid cooling for the CPU as well in case I ever want to overclock that. Uh, what else? It, uh, that's about it. Uh, yeah, it's about it for the interior. And then over in the back, we just got a clusterfuck of cables with the normal uh, power extender over there to just let me plug all my shit in. There we have the audio and whatnot. Here just got a little like arm where I can put some of my shit on. We got like a remote, Sharpie, nothing good. And that does it for the computer set over here. Might as well start talking about the way I record console. So what I have is over here my Elgato Game Capture HD. Argue, not arguably, it is pretty much the best game capture you can get. So pretty much how it works is I'll just plug in whichever console I want to play up into the back over here. And then I have a normal, and we have the USB cord that runs to the computer. You can kind of see that runs to the front. And then the HDMI, this is where it gets pretty ghetto because my monitors actually don't have, they don't accept HDMI and they don't have any speaker output. So I have to do a bit of ghetto rigging here. And so we have the HDMI that leads over to this, which is a JTAC Digital. Uh, HDMI audio extractor, we got the power supply over here, HDMI in and then out. I have an HDMI to DVI adapter and you can see here goes from there, kind of goes behind and then ends up right there. The VGA thing is I use a VGA to a DVI adapter for my computer off in the back. I'll actually show that real quick. I'm not super focused but there you can see it's a little bit of a VGA to HDMI adapter that I had to use. And then, like I said, I had to do that. And then, so the audio extracting it as a uh, just normal red white thing right there, which leads to my Turtle Beaches, which goes over there and connects to that. So that's the only way I can actually have audio when I'm using my monitor. Other than that, just have a bunch of random shit here. It's kind of like stuff I've gathered over the years. Got Archimedes with a sombrero, arguably my greatest collection. Got like a couple controllers up here. Clipboard, got the Kinect for the Xbox One, which I will talk about in a second. Got a old HP touchpad, some more random shit. So, uh, on to the last thing, which is going to be the Xbox, PS4, and whatnot. So, we have the Xbox One here. Uh, all wires pretty much just go behind. And I fiddle with that, but I use that pretty much. I don't yet. I'm waiting for Halo to come out, then we're playing that a shit ton. And then. I bought it back when it was required with the Connect bundle. Now you can get it for like 400 bucks without the Connect, but super nice. Uh, what do we have below? It's kind of have the Xbox mic that I actually haven't even unpacked. And then right here we got the ghetto uh, mic that comes with the PlayStation thing. Sucks a lot. 
Uh, we just got a shit ton of games here, like NBA, Battlefield, all that stuff. Got Plants for Zombies, Garden Warfare. The only game I have, I got my huge collection of Xbox 360 games here. And then down below, uh, we got. Down below, we have a case full of just like computer related stuff, like my old keyboard. Got some cables, like DVI adapters, old headphones, like discs and shit, all that good stuff. And over here, you got the PS4 in the most like low profile, like low profile camouflage situation it could possibly be in. Just not really much to say. Also a good console. Just depends, I guess. And here we got the uh, most. I'm. I'm not even sure how this thing is still functioning. Uh, it's been through some struggles, as in the disk drive refused to work for a couple months. Uh, whenever my friends came over and like changed the disk, you had to be super careful not to like move that at all. Otherwise, it took a half hour of fiddling just to get it to work. Uh, it's the old Xbox 360 arcade. It came with a built-in memory, no hard drive. All I can say is... You have that memory card with 512 megabytes. To zoom in. It's kind of really hard to see. I'm trying to, I don't think you can see it. It's like too, too reflective and shit. Yeah. But it's 512 megabytes, and it's like the old white one. We got the old wireless adapter in the back, and then we actually there wasn't any room, so I had to put the power brick in its own separate thing. And uh, over here to the left, last thing pretty much is we have the Xbox One power brick, uh, PS4. Uh, a garbage can. Uh, PS4 doesn't have a power brick. I don't have a garbage can there, nothing, nothing too big. And then, uh, just my tie I use for live streams sometimes, and big ass, like, 10 foot HDMI cable, I don't it's have to use it anymore. Uh, room tour, nothing, nothing too special, nothing too out of the ordinary, but uh, it's been fun. We're at, right now, I think, time of recording, 22,000 subs, so doing I'm just ridiculous how fast I've been growing lately, and I have you guys to thank for that. I uh, seriously just can't can't thank you guys enough. You guys are the best subscriber, fan base, whatever it is out there. And uh, hopefully we come up on 30k, and I can come up with a cool special for that. I don't know. Uh, I'm actually thinking about doing 50k or 100k, doing uh, Draw My Life. Just a couple of you guys were asking about that. That's gonna about do it. Uh, like I said, hopefully come up on that 30k special. Hopefully you can do a 100k special soon. That'd be ridiculously awesome. And definitely do something super special for that, because at that point YouTube would send me like a play button or whatever, like a trophy, that'd be ridiculous. I'd hang that shit somewhere in my really empty room. But so hopefully you guys did enjoy the video. Uh, as always, if you did, you should like, and it's been Signing out. Love you guys. See ya.